In this episode of Rob Christie Hack Across America, we continue with our mission, try to find something worth doing in every state. This week, we're in California, and we're going back to Yosemite for another day. But first we check into our hotel and get rested up for the night before heading back out the next morning. Now this place was literally just a few miles outside the park and only ran about $85 per night. That was one of the best rooms we had of the entire trip. That and it is right on the Merced River. Now we did get up bright and early to try to beat the crowds, but this is Yosemite and it was a weekend, so no doubt I believe this place is going to be filling up pretty quick. And of course Yosemite is a national park, so your America the Beautiful Pass will work here, otherwise it is $35 per car. Now of all the national parks I've been to, Yosemite is definitely worth $35. Bucks. Now as of this point it seemed like we had the park all to ourselves, there is hardly anybody on the road. But that was all about to change here in about an hour. So we hurried on to our first stop of the day, which was the Royal Arch Cascades. And it's just a five minute walk from the Iwani Lodge parking lot. This is day two at Yosemite. I'm going to our first waterfall of the day. I think this is the staircase waterfall. Quick, easy one. Now I'm glad we got here when we did, because it turns out this area is a pretty popular place for rock climbing. And as we're leaving, quite a few people are coming in with their gear. Actually, a pretty cool little little waterfall. This waterfall actually splits up into two different sides of the rock here. A little rougher getting up this one. Oh, we're almost there. It was short, just real rocky. That's it, we're gonna go on to uh, the upper part of Yosemite Falls. We did the lower part yesterday. Today, we are gonna do the upper part, which is a little bit more of a hike. Now our next stop takes us back to the lower Yosemite Falls trailhead. We're gonna be doing the upper waterfall trail which is accessible from the same parking lot. 
So we're back at Yosemite Falls for a second round. Today we're gonna attempt going to the upper falls, not the very top, but in the middle where the, the falls hit. Uh, we don't know if we'll make it, but we'll, we're gonna give it a try. Now, just like the day before, the parking lots were crowded. So we had to park about a mile down the road and walk it in. Now be forewarned before attempting this trail, it is very strenuous and it's all uphill with a series of switchbacks. It takes about two hours to get to the halfway point and then another two hours to get to the top after that. It's not gonna be a bunch of switchbacks. It'll be a little bit easier. Parking that way down there. <laughs> now you never realize how far you climb until you look down and see a dot that used to be your car. Finally made it to the top. Now we were told that the Columbia Rock was the halfway point, and it took us about an hour and 45 minutes to get to here, but it was still another two hours to get to the top of the waterfalls. We figured this was good enough for the day, and we were gonna head on out from here. If you're one of those people and you're like me, lived in California most of your life, and never went to Yosemite, don't wait till you're almost 50 to do it. Go ahead out there and do it now. This place is absolutely gorgeous and is worth every bit of your time. Here we go. Now, of course, the hike down only took about 35 minutes. Now, I'm glad we did this trail when we did, because by the time we were coming down, this place was packed. It was nonstop people coming up this hill. It's like ants coming up the hill. <laughs> Just nonstop people. Now, this goes without saying, this was probably one of the more strenuous hikes I've done in my life. We finally made it to the bottom. Heading back to the car. Probably the last thing we're going to be doing. Right <laughs> It'll probably be the last thing we do here at Yosemite today. And we'll be heading to Kings Canyon tomorrow. In the next episode of Rob Christie Hike Across America, we continue with our time here in California. We go to Kings Canyon and Sequoia National Parks, check out some of the largest trees we've seen in our lives. So if you found yourself liking this video, you want to see more, Please like, share, subscribe. There's plenty on the channel, more on the way. Till next time, keep on hiking.